Good evening, and thank you for joining us on this Monday, the 3rd of June. Data breaches can cause a huge headache for both companies and consumers. So when an Oahu man got an email saying he needed to have his credit card replaced, he wanted more information to try to keep it from happening again. Sarah Madison has tonight's top story. Sarah? Joe, John Lopinto reached out to us because no one could tell him where his card was compromised. So he went straight to the state to find out what credit card companies are supposed to tell you. John Lopinto tells us that Barclays, the credit card issuer, informed him there was a data breach at a business where he used his credit card. He wanted to know which one, but customer service couldn't say. Then I got a very curious response, which was, well, the merchant probably hasn't made it public yet. Then they said, well, maybe the merchant hasn't secured their database yet. And so, and that even got me more worried. I'm worried that it's a vendor that I do business with all the time. The State Department of Commerce and Consumer Affairs tells us the business is responsible for notifying consumers. The bank may not may not know what what the breach, which company was involved in the breach. They may have been informed by Visa or MasterCard or by a law enforcement authority. When a thousand or more Hawaii residents are affected, the business needs to report it to the state. If it's less than that, the business still needs to contact the individuals. Unless the security breach involves a law enforcement investigation, the notification needs to be done without unreasonable delay. It could be a few days, it could be a week, but it shouldn't be weeks or months. Executive Director Stephen Levins tells us consumers need to be proactive. You could place a fraud alert on your account, do a credit freeze, and check your credit report, which is different from a credit card statement. A credit card report would, would have every single credit card, every single entry on it related to any kind of debt that you have incurred over the years. Barclays sent us a statement saying the notification that was recently sent was not part of any new widespread data breach. Barclays routinely issues new credit cards if it suspects potential fraudulent use due to a previous breach. Back to you, Joe.